Yo, this is Renaj, and this video is going to be a velocity syncing tutorial in Sony Vegas. Um, this is, there's many ways of doing it, but this is just my way. I've been getting a lot of questions on how my edits kind of look smooth, and so I thought I'd make a video on it. Uh, I already have the song in here, and I already have markers to the beats and the clip split to the markers. Um, what you want to do after you have the beats synced and everything you want to right click on the on your video go to insert slash remove envelope and click velocity then once it depend depending on how like big your clip is right here um i usually go 10 keyframes but since the beats are so close i'm only going to go eight in this tutorial so one two three four five six seven eight uh when wherever it lands just double click it it'll make a keyframe you right click it and go to set to. I always set mine to 40. And then it will jump down. And then you go back to this side and just raise it up. And you go to the end of the clip and you do the same thing but backwards. Eight keyframes back into the clip. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Double click to make a keyframe. Then double click at the end so you can raise this up. It's kind of like math. What you do to one side, you have to do to the other. Or that's what I do at least. And we have that part. And what you can do is you can just right click, insert, slash remove envelope, and go to velocity again and do the same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Double click for a keyframe, set to 40. Drag this up. Go to the end of the clip. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight keyframes back into the clip. Double click for a keyframe, then double click at the very end and drag it up. You could keep on doing that throughout the whole entire thing, but that's just tedious and takes a lot of time. So the easy, the shortcut away like around it is to copy and go to the next clip and paste event attributes and it'll do it for you. See how that looks right now. It's looking all right so far. Forgot the splitter right there. Press S on your keyboard to split. Paste. Paste. I'm just going to leave this how it is so it just fades out smoothly. Um, one thing I did forget actually is you can right click on the, the velocity right here and I always put slow fade and it makes it look just a little bit smoother. I'm actually going to have to go back and copy and paste attributes again but you can see it like it curves whenever you paste it. And I don't need it on that part because it's just going to fade out right there. And that's really all I do for my velocity. Um, that's about it really. If you have any more questions just ask below and i'll get to you or just message me on twitter and i'll see what i can do thanks guys